Hey guys, welcome to my video on Excel tutorial. In this video, I'll take you through the HLOOKUP function in Excel. HLOOKUP function is similar to the VLOOKUP function. Only difference between VLOOKUP is that HLOOKUP looks up the value from rows instead of columns. Let's see with the help of an example. In sheet 7, we have a table which is arranged like product ID, name of drugs and quarterly results of that particular drug and we want to transcribe or transport this table in sheet 8 in this format where we have product id then drugs then quarterly values now the product id in sheet 8 is arranged in a different way than in sheet 7 like the order is different i have already used the match function to check it so you can see the order is different now what we can do to look up the values from sheet 7 to sheet 8 that means how we can transport this particular table in this format so what we can do is we can simply write the hlookup function which says the lookup value which is this that is the product id comma the table array which is sheet 7 this is our particular table array F4 freeze it comma row index which is 1 and 2 so row index is 2 comma 0 press enter so now you get your drug name control shift up arrow control D it will copy the drug names down let's just do a cross check 25480 is this drug 24580 yeah that's correct now we need to find out the quarterly results as well in this table so what we can do is equal to each lookup now this is our particular lookup value freeze the column that is column b okay now comma our table array which is sheet 7 so we have our table array from here so we need to take till quarter 4 freeze this particular table with f4 comma row index now every time we need to give two for quarter one and likewise increase what we can do is we can use a match function to dynamically increase the range so our lookup value here would be this particular thing that is quarter one freeze this thing the row number that is three comma our lookup array would be this particular thing freeze it with f4 comma 0 now plus 2 comma 0 i'll tell you the meaning of plus 2 later let's complete this formula first so we have our value now shift and right arrow control r will copy your formulas to the right control down now select this whole portion and press control d it will copy paste your formulas so why did i do plus 2 here let's understand the syntax so b4 is your product id here and then sheet 7 c5 to t10 which is your table array that is this one this particular thing is your table array that is c5 to t10 now the match function says c sheet 8 that is sheet 8 d3 d3 that is this particular value quarter 1 and sheet 7 b7 to b10 which is this particular array then 0 let's see what does it return with f9 you can see the result f9 so it returns 1 so when you get 1 it will return only this particular table now our requirement is 1 2 3 so we want the third position so we have given here plus 2 1 plus 2 that is 3 comma 0 so it gives us the value of this particular quarter request quarter 1 96 so request quarter 1 96 we have our result here by this way you can use the hlookup function if you have data arranged in a different format that was all about hlookup function if you like this video click like and if you have queries write down your comments